cocktail hour cinema talking drinks and cinema we watch and eat some dinner uh, but we don't show you the dinner uh, it's cocktail hour cinema Cheers, everyone, and welcome to Cocktail Hour Cinema. My name is Brent. I am Nico. And I'm Emily. We're a weekly video podcast that talks about movies, TV shows, whatever the fuck we feel like talking about. And usually, our wonderful Emily makes us a themed cocktail based off of whatever it is we're talking about. A craft cocktail. A craft cocktail. But what we're talking about tonight is... Jackass Jackass Forever! Forever. So we felt it was a little more fitting to uh, gaff tape 40s to our hands. This was entirely Nico's idea. guys. It's the second annual trash episode of Cocktail Hour Cinema. Yes, I'm I'm happy these are glass because they were plastic for a long time, or maybe I don't know. I felt like were Mickey's ever plastic? They were, yeah. There's there's plastic mm. versions of Mickey's. Swear to God, twenty one year old me does not remember that. But no, they they switched probably in like the 2010s for mm. a little bit. Interesting. Yeah, this was entirely uh, Nico's idea after years. we did the Four Loco episode, which uh, you should definitely go back and watch it as a masterpiece of podcast cinema. Uh, Nico was like, can Bad we trip. do a 40s next time? I want to do Mickey's. Can we do 40s? And I'm like, fine. Uh, 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 and then we were texting back and forth like, okay, what should we actually like? Should we do different kinds of 40s or whatever? And Nico was adamant about was, it being Mickey's. So. <laughs> I love you some Mickey's. It's like, it is the trash drink. So come on, let's go. Yeah, I mean, yeah. suck it up. I haven't we- had this since I was sixteen. <laughs> I had I was trying to look very cool in front of some kids. We were hanging out underneath a bridge and drinking Mickey's. Yeah, which that That's seems you appropriate. Do. That's where you right? drink Mickey's That's is you underneath the bridge. Yeah. yeah, and I thought I was like, oh, I, c- I could totally do it. And I tried to chug as much as I could, and I was like, this is fucking awful. <laughs> <laughs> we used to play a game when we were like twenty-one years old, called the brown bag game, BBR baby, where we would get in Nico's garage or my garage or whoever's garage was handy and keep these in a brown bag. And the winner was the one who finished it first, but you don't get to see oh, right, where right. everyone else is at. also playing card games to kind of keep yeah. our mind off of it too. And also to distract. You're right. waiting till like someone's focused on the card game and you mm. kind of like chug it down. Yep. It's honestly not as bad as I thought it would get, get, uh, going to be. It's good. It, it just tastes not. like a shitty beer. We have some orange juice here to make it a brass monkey is what we call it. Yeah. So uh, <laughs> when, once you get it a little bit further down, <laughs> usually like around here, this, this point, you pour a little bit of or- orange juice in Nico's there. the bartender today. It's, he's yeah, he's you know? coming in with all the, the tips and tricks. Crafty. You know? Also, mm-hmm. that bottle makes it look like fancy orange juice. It is like <laughs> yeah. the shittiest orange juice of all time. <laughs> <That's sick. laughs> it has easily been... Over twelve years, probably since I've had a brass monkey, or maybe even a forty. I'm not. Since, I'm sure the last since time maybe the the last Jackass movie. Yeah, I'm gonna oh say it's this. Maybe this is all about nostalgia. So what better time? Yeah. To- <laughs> and how nostalgic this movie was. Yes, it was. It was so much fun. The three so of us much, had yeah. such fucking a fucking great yeah, time. It was, it was a great movie theater experience. A lot of heart in this movie. I wish we saw it in more of like a full theater, which is something weird to say uh, in COVID times, but. Because there was hardly anybody in there. It was like us and like a couple little crews behind there us. Was, yeah. yeah, it was. There was like a good amount of laughter going on, but we were definitely laughing the hardest out of yeah. anybody. But year. it was kind of nice to be able to like we like talked through the whole thing. Like we were like, yeah, yeah. This is the kind of movie that it's okay to do that, right? In. Even also, if it was more full, we'd probably be okay to talk a little bit. Yeah. To be fair, just to like you know cover our bases here, right. we were sitting in the row where like there's the walkway, and we were like the first row the of the next section. That way. Uh, you it's know. funny. Our previous episode had like a PSA about not talking in the theater, and then like now <laughs> we, we weren't <laughs> <That> talking. <laughs> we weren't talking. We were just like making little comments sure, and like sure, sure. yeah, and we like weren't... oh my god. Yeah, actually, we were talking loudly. Like we when something were. would happen, we'd be like Jesus Christ. We're just there reacting. Was other people, there's other people talking. Reacting. In the theater yeah, less too, less yeah. like chit chatting and more just yeah. like. A lot it's of, not a lot the of Matrix. O's. There's right. not a, a plot that you're trying <laughs> no. to keep track of. You know, oh yeah, man. this movie was bold. Oh, it had a lot of nails. balls. Oh, so many balls, so many penises, so many balls, so many balls and penises. Big old balls. <laughs> I mean, that's a staple in every jackass film, but because they can't do that a lot, on the there's show. There's a lot of staples in this, <laughs> right? <It's> like, right. <laughs> half the movie was penises and balls. It is. It was kind of funny because, like, we're all nostalgic. Anyone who's around our age that has grown up on Jackass is really nostalgic for like the main crew of Jackass. Mm-hmm. But they, there's fresh blood in this film, which was yeah, kind of fun. Yeah, they bring like, a new like squad. That. They, I love that because they, you, you know, they can't do all the things they used to do. Yeah, 
yeah. So they're like, let's bring moments. in some people that are willing to like actually get fucked up. Mm. And like Pontius and Johnny got to take like a more of like a producer role. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were the ringmasters yeah. more than mm. they didn't really do all that much. They didn't. Johnny was in like a few things. I mean, he he, he was got, only in one risky one. I mean, and he got. Fucked. I think that's the reason why he wasn't in more bits. Is maybe that was filmed early or something? Because he got to assume that so was later. In I went, yeah, because he broke his wrist, right? I yeah. went yeah. to I the, have to assume they probably saved that for later on, just in case he actually got fucked up. Well, I was gonna say, uh, I went to the restroom. Unfortunately, at the part where he got like mauled by a bull, did he have gray hair or did he have dark hair? Dark because. Hair. Okay, so then that was filmed earlier on because they oh. like they filmed this in like two sections and he stopped dyeing his hair halfway oh. through. So when you see gray hair, that's later in the production. I believe it was I, I believe it was brown when that happened. I don't quite can't oh. say for sure, but I believe it was brown when that I believe happened. it was brown too. He had a hat on, so I can't remember. That's exactly. true. That's true, but he put <laughs> he put the put, fucking pig He put pig semen, semen in the hat and then put it on his head. <laughs> and then he gets out of the hospital and they're like, he's like, uh, when I put the hat on the there wasn't supposed to be any pig semen that fell. Did pig semen come down? Oh the guy's God. like, I don't know. I, I think so. And he's just like, oh, it's like, that's the first thing you say. I mean, you're being wheeled that's out of the hospital. priority. He woke up from a hardcore concussion. Yeah. Like Jesus. He was knocked yeah, out. He was out. He was breathing weird. He was like, <laughs> he was like, <laughs> yeah. I was like, oh shit. It's oh, the shit. death rattle. Oh. God. Which is funny because I don't know which one it was, but it was kind of the same thing where, where, one of the earlier ones, he did the bull thing, and he got mm. fucked up from it. And yeah, it's like, hot take: a bull will fuck you up. Yeah, Why do you will. keep doing it, man? Do the other shit. I think he got more fucked up on this one than he did in the last one. Yeah, because he's ten years older. He's got it's older more fragile, bones. But he got tossed like a rag doll. He did like four flips before he hit the floor. Right. So here's a fun fact: as I burp, because we're drinking forties, yeah. um, Johnny Knoxville had to have a, a catheter for three years after a 2017 stunt that wasn't even for jackass it was like for some other little show some other little bit that it was like it wasn't even planned for him to do it but was he it, oh was i it, think was, I was heard it the this. theme park movie that he did well, no that's a different thing okay. that he got fucked up on this was like for him just showing up to do like a little bit in a, in a different show or something okay. and they're like hey we have this little motorcycle we have this little thing like you should do a stunt and he's like yeah fuck it i'll, I'll give it a shot oh he's trying to do a backflip on a motorcycle mm. Not not planned, not practiced. Just oh yeah, I'll, I'll give it a shot. Ends up the, the he lands with it going into his like stomach or something. Uh. And long story short, he had to like pee out of a catheter. I for heard three oh, years from 2017 Fuck, to 2020. Three years. Now that you mentioned that uh, a podcast that I listen to, where it's like hosted by some drag queens, some of them did like press for the new jackass movie and one of them just offhanded mentioned like oh yeah johnny his dick works now because he broke his urethra before and oh. I, it was just like an offhanded comment i'm like whoa whoa back 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 that up what what yeah <laughs> it went into his dick that was right, it went, right. It, it, he turned it like this and landed on it and it went broke his, so many broken broke dicks his pee-pee. in this movie too squished dicks squished squished dicks bit dicks bit dicks opening scene bitten dick stung stung, stung, stung dicks stung dicks hockey pucked dicks Oh, okay. <laughs> Shout out to Aaron? fucking Aaron. Can we talk about Aaron, dude, please? Dude, he was the MVP. Aaron, I opinion. really hope you watch this this episode of he Cocktail Hour Cinema, buddy, because Jesus you... Jesus Christ, dude. Your dick <laughs> is not going to work anymore. They were doing There's the no cup way. test. They were referencing back to an old classic uh, jackass skit. Skit. Mm. Bit. Uh, and before it was like, oh, Johnny Knoxville is wearing it and little toddlers are kicking him in the dick, which in and of itself, that's a good test of a cup. Mm-hmm. Uh, they took it up a, a handful of notches <laughs> in this one. They had, Fuck um, I, I do not remember his name, but like a heavyweight boxer who has Francis like. Francis. Ne- Damn, I forgot his name. We'll put, we'll put the text down this below. Guy. This guy. This uh, guy. Hardest punch in the world. Hardest punch in the world. And he punched him in the dick. And then they had the <sighs> fastest softball pitcher pitch it into his dick. And then a professional hockey player oh, like, slap shotted it into his dick. Aaron. For that one, he, he had a metal cup. And it dented and it. And it dented <laughs> the fuck out of it. And then oh, it so bad. the final one, which I was nauseous after watching uh they jumped with a pogo stick onto his dick um, oh that, that was the worst one that one was hands down the worst one it left mm. like cut his ball sack open yeah, yeah it like p- 
punctured his ball sack essentially, and that was the first time we saw uh, Lance. Is it Lance? The what? The camera guy who always throws up. Lance, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he threw up at, at that <laughs> into his mask. They're all wearing masks. It's COVID. Oh he throws God. up into his mask, and you hear someone just go, "Can we get another mask?" Over here? <laughs> <laughs> I think okay. One of my favorite, favorite, favorite parts about Jackass is the fact that. About half of the film is just them fucking with each other. Yeah. And yeah. They, they all know going into it that they're going to get fucked with, that Johnny's going to come up with all these little things. He just like, has a taser in his pocket. Never enter a porta potty. Yeah. Right. On set, ever. <laughs> the, what, the, one of the directors was even like, if these guys trust us enough to like go to the bathroom at any point today, they're stupid. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's nice to see Steve O. Sober. Looking healthy. He looks yeah. great. He looks great. Yeah. He does look great. He's yeah. still, he sounds like this. Yeah, yeah that's just his, <laughs> he that's looks just he looks good, but he sounds like he's not gonna be able to talk when he's like 16. Yeah, he sounds awful. But <laughs> I love him. I love it's, him. It's so a charming, it's a charming, lovable. raspy, yeah. What a lovable guy. That guy mm. is so fucking lovable. I'm so happy that he's in contrast sober to, and happy. to Bam Margera, who is not doing too well for himself right now. Yeah, right now. He was right doing now. better than a lot of other a lot of other people because the cast has been like rampant with drug and alcohol problems on and off. Mm-hmm. Surprisingly, right. a lot of them have gotten clean, like mm-hmm. almost to a surprising amount. Obviously, Ryan Dunn, rest in peace. Yeah. Um, that one sucked. But Bam was originally supposed to be a part of this movie. Mm-hmm. And the production team told him like, OK, well, we're going to we're going to monitor your like you getting sober again because he was sober. Right. And then he started drinking again, like kind of soon before the movie. Like, we're going to monitor your your health. And he was basically like, no, like, he made a couple of videos online in 2021 that were basically like, who gives a shit if I'm drunk for jackass? Like, we've all been fucked up the whole time we were filming it and just mm. said a bunch of, and he was like, drunk, I didn't know all that. posting that videos sucks. online. Yeah. He kind of created a lot of bad press for himself. And eventually, the rest of the cast, too, was like, dude, we want you to be in it. Like, get clean, get your shit together. We want you to be in it. And he didn't. And he wasn't in the film at all. And I, I missed him. It was yeah. it was kind of weird not yeah. seeing him. But even in the, uh, the uh, throwback footage at the end, in the end credits, I was like, oh, man. Like, there was like did, one clip of Bam. I in think there. I saw I think I saw a little bit of Bam, but there was like one little bit. Yeah. Was, from, was there? Mm-hmm. I just I just assumed that they couldn't use any of it. Yeah, I didn't, so I didn't think I didn't so think I saw him. At all. He, I was like looking for him. I don't think he was in it at all because he was. I could be wrong. It looked like it was. It's a grainy, lot of them kind of look each, like it's each grainy other. Grainy ass footage from 2000. So who the fuck knows? I mean, he was like threatening to sue Jackass. Mm. He so. he went online and told like his followers to not go see the movie to like yeah. protest the movie. Oh, that's a bummer. Isn't that's, that a bummer? That yeah. sucks. Yeah, and he, it, uh, I think he did like file a, a lawsuit against them. So well, that sucks. That's why I'm like, oh, they, they just can't use any footage of him or even mention his name. You know, especially because. So. I that that sucks because like Bam was always one of my favorites yeah. growing up. I'm so fun. Like. I feel like my puberty years through middle school, it was like Jackass, Wild Boys, and Viva La Bam were oh, all Wild on. Boys. And they just, honestly, Wild Boys, now I would watch again because you honestly learn a lot about animals on that fucking yeah, show. It was genuinely educational. Two birds. Yeah. <laughs> Two birds. But I there like. There was some shit on that show that like irked me so bad that I almost didn't want to watch it though. Oh. Yeah. Just so, because Steve O was I mean, like, Steve O was just on a, a whole nother level of like addiction and jackassery during that. Mm. And there's some shit he did. I actually don't remember if it was on wild boys or jackass, but God. the one stunt that I can think of of Steve-O that, that is coming back to me is when he put a fish hook through his. Oh cheek yeah. And then and jumped, then jumped into, the water. into shark infested waters. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah Watching yeah, yeah. him put the hook through his cheek. I was just like, dude, no. That, like this is a little bit too far for me. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> this that this was... is the moment where it's gone too far for me. Yeah, that was bad. That was awful. But it was also because you could tell he was like fucked up. Yeah. And yeah. it's like you just feel bad that like Yeah, now this dude that is, wouldn't like, not age mentally well, there. But... And, no, yeah, yeah, that wouldn't they wouldn't happen now, I don't think. No. no. Definitely not. But God, but I blame that era on uh, numb, I know, it hurts. my pinky I know. finger. I can't feel it anymore. It kind of feels fitting that it like is painful. It is <laughs> for for the jackass fitted episode. So tight and yeah. snug. It's gonna take so long to get through this. Uh, we can't end the episode until we're done. By the way, uh, this I'm gonna have to. Out. People no, are gonna finish the, the episode. People are gonna finish the episode, which is fine. Don't feel makes the dream work, baby. Don't feel like you have to stay for the whole thing. It's fine. We're. We're not even gonna review much. We're just kind of kind of bullshit about how funny Jackass is. Do birds? Um, <laughs> uh, do birds? <laughs> yeah, do a little more. Do a little more. All right, if we're doing it, 
It's, it's got to have that uh, that pig cum consistency. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh, so educational moment. Two birds. Speaking of yeah. education about animals. <laughs> not not a whole lot. Just just a bit. Just a tip. Um, See how it feels. Just a yeah. Just the tip. A little more than that. A little more. A little bit or a lot. Whatever. The no, fucking. not a little bit or a lot. Just a. Uh, that's good, right there. That's good. Say um, when, like the Parmesan. Right. Um. So, pigs. For is licking the wall. <laughs> Speaking of animals, yeah. so pigs for for their body weight, for their size, uh, excrete the most amount of semen of any animal. Mm. Let's do a little. Uh, you you folks at home, let's do a little shot bet amongst yourselves. How many ounces of semen do you think a pig uh, ejaculates per session? We'll each give one. We'll each give one. We'll mm. do an ABC each of us. Okay. Is it five ounces? Is it seventeen ounces? Is it nine ounces? And the answer is... It's 17 fucking ounces. <laughs> it's more than a fucking beer. It's a beer's worth of semen. Yeah. That's too much, pigs. Get it together. That's too much. Uh, and Chris Pontius just takes a casual ship out, a sip out of it for like no reason. Like a gulp. Reason. A gulp of yeah. it, not a sip. It wasn't yeah, like a like, planned thing. They were just He was just holding it and he just like, looks at the camera and is like, Oh my god, so gross! <sighs> semen. That's just pig god. semen, dude. <laughs> it's so well, Chris gross. Pontius also mentions he's like because I think I don't remember if it was in the show or one of the jackasses, but he drank horse semen and then he like looks at him and he's like, you know, honestly, it's been a while since I had the horse semen, but I prefer the pig. I prefer semen. the pig semen. <laughs> I do prefer the pig semen. <laughs> Come connoisseur. <laughs> Also, in case I, <laughs> in case it wasn't clear, mom, if you're watching this, go away. Don't, don't. This isn't the yeah. one. This isn't for you, moms. Any this, parents no, listening? Go. Not the one. <laughs> Turn it off. If you, if you're still watching after that conversation. Yeah. <laughs> okay. This is this is a fun little experiment. What do you think? Like, do you think your mom would be able to get through no. seeing any of the Jackass films? No. At all? Mm, no. No. Not no way no. in hell. My mom like was annoyed with me that I would be watching it at home in general. Like, I would Mine too. do the like. Have it, and then have the little uh, the button on the remote that goes to a different channel really quick. The last button, just like, last oh button. no, I was watching uh, the Discovery Channel. Yeah, no, Love totally. Yeah, the, the Discovery button. Channel. <laughs> the right. Discovery Channel. <laughs> oh, I was just being educated, mom. Yeah. <laughs> 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 We're gonna punch these guys in the dick. I'm like, oh, no, um, no, no, no. I didn't just it's, watch a guy in a shopping cart. Talking about Moby Dick. Talking about Moby Dick. Yeah, don't yeah. worry about it. Bob Ross. <laughs> <laughs> Learning how to paint a, a mountain. Not, <laughs> not watch Johnny Knoxville <laughs> face plant out of a shopping cart. Yeah. There were no shopping carts in this movie. No shopping carts. That was one bit of nostalgia that we oh, didn't yeah. get. No shopping cart. I didn't hmm. even think about that. Weird. Weird. It's like iconic for the franchise, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, that's how it started, really. Well, yeah, because Jackass 3, they had the giant shopping cart that like, like all of them could fit in. And that right. was the opening scene right. of that one. Did you guys ever do that? Am I remembering that correctly? Or is I guess this is a question for Nico. Did you ever hmm. get pushed while in a shopping cart? Excuse me. I have done that. You've done that? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, I've done it too. Yes, I absolutely yeah, we, have. I think we did it together oh, yeah. probably yeah. at some point. Skater boy. You've done that? Yes. Did you eat shit? No. It like it, it luckily it like hit the curb and I kind it like it tipped over sideways. I didn't get launched oh, out. Oh, I got launched. It, it sucked. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm not surprised that you assumed I hadn't done that, but I, I'm, I'm a surprised. little I'm very surprised that you have done it. I am surprised too. I was very uh not that I was very cool. I was very desperate to look cool in middle school. Let's just uh, say that. I really wanted to impress the boys that I hung mm. out with. <laughs> Cute. We all, we all did that. Not some, stupid shit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, we all do stupid shit. I used to backflip off of everything. That was my thing. Mm. I, had a, I had a Ford Ranger truck that I was like, oh, like I'll backflip off the tailgate being down. And then it was like, well, I'll backflip off the side of the truck. And then it was like, can I backflip off the top of the truck? Did it. Did the all roof. those things. Yeah. I didn't necessarily do those kinds of things, but I I was always down to like, oh, I'll snort wasabi and that kind of thing. Mm. I did I did a lot of that kind of jackassy stuff in mm. middle school. Uh. Um, pop rocks? Have you ever snorted pop rocks? Oh, oh God, no. no, it's miserable. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> kind of refreshing. <laughs> it's like some people complain about cocaine, but have you ever tried right. to snort pop rocks? Holy shit, yeah, those rocks hit, bro. It's a Every, gateway drug. Everything's <laughs> making sense now. <laughs> 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 Oh, I think I just I need to call my therapist. Real quick. <laughs> we're, we're doing poppers. Salt. 
<laughs> solving some childhood Pop- poppers trauma. are something completely different. Oh yeah. All oh, right, right. Nico knows all about that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, maybe Johnny Knoxville was like set up for jackass because when he was a kid. <laughs> I know. Oh, were you uncomfortable? Oh, my my pinky <laughs> finger is like. I know. I I had to hurting. release my my middle finger because it was just uh, pressing into my fingernail. I too. ripped a little hole for my thumb to have a little breathing. <laughs> we all we all gotta. We're all cheating. Stop! Stop it! Stop, stop it. it! Stop it! Nothing. He's trying to make himself more comfortable, producer. Nothing, father. Nothing. Uh, we're fine. Nothing, father. Nothing. My nothing. tiny finger hurts. So he's gonna staple that hey, tape to your finger. It, it, <laughs> and now your back's gonna hurt. <laughs> he's full of landscaping duty. duty. It could be worse. My finger it could hurts. be milk. We could be strapped to something oh spinning in circles, the merry-go-round. puking all over each other. Yeah, that's right. While explosions go off was in the background. Was it milk? Like colored milk? Yeah, they had to drink milk and Ugh. puke on themselves. Yeah. Oh, so Nico knows this. It's, ever since I've been a kid, I, I can't do I can't do pukey stuff. Like pukey stuff. That, there's that's a specific kind of phobia. I don't remember the name of it. But well, yeah. I don't know if it's necessarily a phobia, but it, but it makes it, me puke. Yeah, if it makes you puke. Yeah. So at that point in the theater, this is the only point in the movie I had to do it, but I kind of assumed at some point I would. I had to plug both of my ears and stare at the ground. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you can't him do it. I fully, I fully like... Oh, I saw no, him do no, it. No, 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 no. <laughs> He's like, oh, no, I'm not going to eat this. I'm going to eat this. But I, I came back. I came back and I watched like six people puke. And I didn't throw up. I was very proud of myself. And then you watched them get annihilated by paintballs. <laughs> that was pretty fun. Was I like fantastic. that part a lot better. Yeah, yeah. The, I like the, the, the budget, the creativity that they had. Mm-hmm. And yeah. this was fucking great. The engineering of some of these yeah. fucking... Bits Dude, like, I don't know the the the, the yellow fist <laughs> slamming. <laughs> so simple, board. so simple. Like a ten second bit. Yeah, that they didn't just, show any yeah. of the before or any of the no, after. It, it was fucking what a weird fucking bit. <laughs> <laughs> like some guy dressed in a giant yellow fist, full on like spearheads a guy on a skateboard. Right. That that's kind it. of shit. That like that's still I think my favorite jackass bit. The one that sticks in my head. Is it the one you're thinking of too, with the hand where they like set yeah, up the right. hand behind the door? Yeah, 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 yeah. Like that's makes me cry laugh every that, fucking time. That in general, like that bit of Jackass where it's just them fucking with each other, mm. my favorite part of Jackass. The, right. the the huge stunts and like the theatrics and like the shit that makes you go like, oh my god, I can't fucking believe it. Mm. That's all fun, but the reason that I love Jackass as much as I do is because so much of it is like pretty harmless. A little painful, but not Harmless. that painful. Like getting <laughs> fucking punched in the balls by the heavyweight champion of the no, world. That's not, bro. Not, that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking oh. about the other bits where it's like them, you know, them ordering coffee in this little like air bag. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're all fine. Like it's you're not, not really or, hurting. The bit, like them. I think it was during the credits where a guy's stepping out of a trailer with a big tray of coffee and the, yeah. the, stairs, the stairs, the collapse. stairs just yeah. collapse and <laughs> just it everywhere. That and shit. Like, and one where like that a was guy another, that was another like five second bit that just was in there same during the credits there's a guy just running towards a doorway with a fucking piece <laughs> of wood he just slams into the doorway and falls over full like, speed sprint it was so funny it was so funny clotheslining himself basically <laughs> wow yeah th- the creativity is, is what it's gets great. me you know, I, I love it I feel like they, they planted the seed for this one for you to see how they can keep this ball rolling because new, they're all so fucking bed. old that you're like th- this is the last one there's no fucking way yeah and then you're watching it and you're like oh okay they're basically producers and executive producers Aaron's still getting the shit kicked out of him. Aaron. Yeah, Aaron's gotten the shit under the well, stick in every fucking movie like uh, he does a lot of fucked up shit I do like that they casted new people but like they're they're inferior to like the original cast. We just don't have the. I did like the poopies. Poopies. <laughs> poopies. Dude, shout out to poopies. Dude, shout poopies. out to poopies. One because it's so funny when you do something crazy, we get to go poopies. Oh, uh, poopies! That's, thank you for that. Great name. Just Great right name. off the bat, we're immediately ingratiated <laughs> right. to poopies. Because like, all right, poopies. Three it's people your in turn. our thirties <laughs> yelling poopies. He's also such an idiot. Such a funny <laughs> He's very stupid. He's just He's like very stupid. Lucky California, bro. Dude, like everything yeah, he yeah. says sounded like dude, this, dude. The trivia thing, he like did not make himself look good at all. <laughs> no, <he did> not. <laughs> we have a girl jackass <laughs> now too. Oh yeah, she was great. She was great. Yeah. Rachel, I fuck. Rachel, I feel yeah, such an yeah, asshole. Yeah. I don't remember. But, uh, it was Rachel. Yeah, it was Rachel. Okay. 
She got stung in the face by a scorpion was, over and over again. I was gonna say she <laughs> didn't do that much, but she didn't that do that bit. much. But that was her. That was her moment. That was yeah. a good moment. That was a good moment. Getting for her. stung in the fucking face by a scorpion. Scorpion Botox is what that one. Permission. Was yeah. Oh. At what point? <laughs> <laughs> that was so fucking. These good. scorpions because they're trying to hold it up to her lips to sting her lips and it yeah. falls on her boob. She's like, get it off my boob. Get it off my boob. And, <laughs> and Chris. Chris, Chris is like. Pontius is like uh, G- give me permission. Can he's I have like, permission? He's like, I can't, yeah. I can't touch, uh, I can't get it off your boob unless you give me permission. She just goes, permission! 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't <give> consent! <laughs> Dude, we, oh, we were all, so we were, funny. we were just laughing hella hard yeah. for like the next like that five minutes. That was fucking great. That was fucking great. I think my favorite bit in this movie was the uh, Silence of the Lambs one where they started out fucking with poopies. like groups oh, of dude, two. That- Oh, that one made me like anxious. I actually yeah. legitimately anxious. So fucking that. funny. So they brought like <laughs> groups of two in and they kind of set it up where they think that they're going to do something with a rattlesnake. And so they like show them the rattlesnake. It's a real fucking snake. It's mm. huge. And then like take them out of the room and they're like, okay, we're going to reset it up. We just want to give you kind of, you know, a lowdown of what's going to happen. They bring them back in the two, like two at a time. <laughs> slam the door turn off all the lights lock the door and it's just like johnny knoxville with night vision goggles <laughs> like <laughs> fucking with them the entire time and, and chris pontius, and chris pontius it's called they si- don't even know he's in there it's called silence of the lambs because chris pontius is wearing a silk robe and just tucking the entire time and he's, <laughs> right. tucking, he's and just, just dancing in the it, background it's great because like the camera will just like pan like, and over him and, and they don't even see. know he's there they yeah, literally yeah, yeah, don't yeah, even yeah, know yeah. he's there no interaction with chris at all, and that's just honestly that makes it way fucking funnier to me. Out of focus in the background, just... and you see him just moments. It was just the camera, <laughs> so good. not even focus on him. Like it's Emily. Oh and yeah, like, and so... then they put a little sound in the mm-hmm. barrel that sounds like a rattle. And at one point, they push the barrel over off. They, the they table switch out the barrel so there's no snake in the room anymore. Mm. But like after they've been fucking with them for a little bit. They push the barrel off the table and then they cue like a rattle sound that sounds like the rattlesnake is like on the floor yeah. in front of them. There's like, no, dude, fuck this, dude. No, no fucking way. <laughs> yeah, but I, I liked uh, when, when they found a door to escape yes. in and then it's a room full of hanging pots and pants. And He's like, just, no, dude, it's a room. It's a room. Let's, let's go. Let's go. And the guy's like, what do you think is in that room? Like yeah. one guy was smart enough to know. That's the creativity I loved. Yeah. Like. Hanging that's pots and pans, example. and then yeah. like the tacks and marbles on the oh, ground, and mouse traps, and, and then a table full of mouse traps. Oh. See, that was harmful. Poor okay. Zach, dude. Fuck, Zach. Fucking Zach, Zach, new new boy Zach, new boy Zach. He like runs, falls on the tacks and marbles, and uh, then like and the mouse hops traps. over the mouse trap. He feels table. like the, with the thumb tacks, man, oh, just pointing up. And he just too much. All like three hundred and fifty pounds of that dude just like yeah, rolling just, over it. I will oh. say, I think Zach. Zach took some fucking risks. Yeah. Like oh, yeah. shout out out of out of the whole new crew, Zach had to have been the most used badass. Yeah, <laughs> used. used. They used the fuck they out used of him a lot. Every yeah. bit. He was in the the triple wedgie one. Yeah. Was like, oh, we got I would two say big he's the new Preston, now. but can... Preston was also in this movie quite a bit. Uh, yeah. A lot. Oh yeah. Preston a lot. is still yeah. but Preston is still a part of it. Definitely the, the new pants. <laughs> yeah. yeah. God damn it. That was. And you know what's gross. you know what's funny? I actually we, I had to look away from the screen. I'm not. Yeah, lie. that was fucking gross. That, that's the kind of sh- that's the kind of shit. Yeah, that I don't like. That was too much. I didn't like that, <laughs> but much. just him standing there in like a silver spandex suit, and he's oh. just like, I shit my pants. I shit my pants. We <laughs> we never got to see oh, what he was actually what? gonna film. Yeah. No, no, they didn't put they the whatever the stunt he was actually gonna do. <laughs> just... He shit himself. They showed him shit himself and admit and then, that he shit himself, and that was it. That and they call it a day, and that's funny enough. Let's go on to the next. <laughs> well, they, they probably we they probably still filmed the bit, but it's like how many bits didn't make the movie? Yeah, are oh, they going to do a Jackass right. Forever right. point five like they did with right. well, two and two? 2. 5? I think yeah. yeah. If Blu-rays were still around, they would have uh, a, a huge bonus. R.I.P. Blu-rays. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Just, R.I.P. Blockbuster. You know. Aww. We used to rent Jackass from Blockbuster. And I was watch a Hollywood together. video gal because that was too, closer girl, to my house. Bitch. Hollywood video, girl, bitch. Girl, bitch. <laughs> Me too, girl, bitch. <laughs> Hollywood <laughs> video. Hollywood that was that was video. their jingle. What was the little jingle? Game crazy. Did yours have a game crazy? It was like huh? Hollywood video, something like that. Oh, game crazy. Wasn't that the game shop that was attached yeah. to it? Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, yeah. What was uh, the little spot in Niles? Oh yeah. Uh, what was the little spot in Niles? Uh, highlight video. Highlight video. Oh, oh yeah, that's that dude loved me, Nico. Yeah. Hey. Nico. And then you could play Nintendo sixty four in the back, <laughs> and we would hit up Seven Eleven, get Slurpees. Yep. Go to Hollywood Video, play some hi- video highlight games. video, 
play like Goldeneye for like a couple minutes. Ride our bikes over yeah, to the fucking Dude's like, are you going to rent something or are you just going to fucking play video games? Man. Just gonna play We're just going to play video games. Good We're old days. Children. Here's a sweet pick of me and Brent's back in the day. Aw. Yeah. Aw. Aw. Got to bring that haircut back, man. Yeah. You really do. Bowl cut that shit. Yeah, mushroom uh, head. The, the mushroom head. Yeah. I don't know, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. All right. Do it. <laughs> I'm doing it. <laughs> do it for jackass. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> My hair was straight back then. My hair's all curly now. Mm. Do it. Who is your favorite jackass? Uh, super easy answer. <laughs> it's Johnny, and I know that's cliche and stupid, no. but no, no there's don't, don't, don't put yourself down like that. <laughs> <laughs> there's no jackass without Johnny. You be a basic bitch, dude. He's he's, he's the most likable oh. fucking guy. I got Johnny yeah. facts all day, but I want you guys to answer your question that you just posed for the group before I go into him. I, mean, I like Chris. Chris yeah, Chris, just, uh, Chris. Chris is my favorite. Chris is my Chris favorite. is my favorite. I really liked Ryan Dunn. I will oh. say Ryan was R. way R. up there for he, me. He yeah, because he that like, death hurt. He was sure. down for fucking anything, anytime, and like, but he was like deadpan about everything. <laughs> like he just seemed like a cool ass dude. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't, I didn't remember him honestly. Oh, see, if he was, a, he was just another jackass member. Did you ever me. watch Viva La Bam though? Because he was in like every episode of Viva. La Bam. I didn't watch Viva La Bam. So him yeah. and Bam, they were best friends. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, that's sad. Bam is yeah. a very, very... Well, I, I knew it was sad, and, you know, people like Brandon. I just... Yeah. Who's your favorite? He was, he was never on my... Uh, Chris. Chris. Oh, yeah. Pon- Pon- Pontier? Pontius. Obviously, Pontius. Steve-O is way the Pontier? fuck up there, too. Pontier. Pontier. Steve-O's way up there, Oh, too. Steve-O's way oh, up yeah, there. Yeah, 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 He's yeah. so fucking likable. Talk about a miracle story. Like, that guy, I think, is... God. If you have ever known anyone that has had a drug problem, Steve-O should be who you point at for... Someone who had like the worst problem. Like yeah. I don't know how he didn't kill himself to a he complete tried. rebound. Yeah, yeah he, he tried, tried to kill himself. Yeah. He would go to a Lowe's parking lot and do whippets until he passed out. Right. Yep. And then just wake up and just like, oh, I'm still alive. And just like go on with his day. And you know what made it harder for him to get clean is I was research researching a little bit today and, and was reading about this, but he he idolized, you know, like like Motley Crue and these yeah. rock bands oh, and like, you yeah, know, so. all these different actors and, and rock stars, many of whom died because of their addiction. Mm. And he would talk, he would like talk shit about people that would get clean. Like when he was oh. in that phase of his life, That's, someone would get clean. And he'd be like, this fucking pussy got clean. And everyone was like, Oh, Steve, was going to die. Cause his yeah, mentality towards getting clean was like, you're never going to do it. Right. God, and I'm now so look glad. at him. I'm so yeah, glad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He he's a stand up comedian. He saw clean as his weakness because, like, right. Yeah. Because yeah. he was just so fucked. Mm-hmm. But he's he's gotten clean. He stayed clean. He started stand up comedy. He was, like, pretty bad at it at first, but he's actually kind of decent at it now. Dude's got stories, that's for sure. All so. day. <laughs> he just sit down and just talk stories, man. That, that's all he has to do. Really. That was one of the things that started to blow him up is he started to do this segment at the end of his stand up shows where it's basically like, Hey, let me tell you about a time that I did cocaine with a celebrity, and he would just like <laughs> he would just out a celebrity, like the, oh, and that was how he started. That, like, some of them went viral online, and that was kind of how he started building like a following for his stand-up show. Is he Sorry. he told it? I watched him tell his story right, about right. Kid Rock, where he's like, "Yeah, like I happened to be in Vegas for something, and Kid Rock was in Vegas, and like he randomly hit me up, and was like, yo, come to my hotel room,' and I opened the door." And there's like a mountain of cocaine oh, on the table. And he's just like, yo, Steve-O, come do all this cocaine with me. And it's like, <laughs> just outed. All of it? The outed whole thing? Kid Rock. Damn. <laughs> I mean, is anybody fucking surprised you look no, at course, Kid Rock? Right. And- do, you, do you remember when Steve-O duct taped himself to a billboard? Yes. And oh, then we, yeah. remember like in our group chat, we like, we're watching it live. Right. Yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, while it was what happening. What was that for? Was it like to advertise he, for a jackass? No, or? he was promoting either his podcast or a show he was about to do. Yeah, I re- yeah, that was. Yeah, police yeah. came so and they funny. got pissed and he had to get down. <laughs> right, right, right. Boo. I boo. <laughs> Just let him do it. Let him do yeah. it. Fucking chaos. Let's go. Dude, it wasn't lo- going to fall. Watching that live was just a core memory for me. Right? <laughs> <laughs> My graduation and watching Steve-O on a billboard. <laughs> My graduation, 9-11, Steve-O on a billboard. 9-11 is a core memory. Kind of, I mean, it yes, is. Yes, actually, to be oh, honest. Yeah, it's a trauma memory. <laughs> Whether we want to or not. Yeah. That's true. That's true. So, hard that, hard pivot. Let's talk about 9-11 for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> How y'all we're do- pounding 40s. How are y'all doing on your uh, on your? I think we're all around the same around? spot, actually. I think I'm, Nico's I'm beating, here. Oh, Nico's beating the shit out of us. <laughs> <laughs> Not my first time. 
Hey, producer, Ryan, could you do me a favor? Could you fix the the clock? I was trying to clock tell you is, with my eyes that yeah. the clock, Thank- the, the cord was, there you go. Thank you. Thank Thanks, you, oh, man, I'm so P-Dog. Full. 30, we're at 36 right now? Okay, we should probably wrap this up. No, we got to finish these. We got to finish. All right. It's not like you have to add graphics. Just let oh, it go. you're right. You're right. Just let it go. We're just bullshitting. You wipe. But we got to finish. You wipe. You wipe. We got to finish it first. You wipe. Uh, I did want to tell a little bit, like, we, you know. It's like Brent's I got do, fun facts. I do want to talk a little bit about, like, the formation of Jackass, because it is kind of interesting. Fun yes. fact corner. Um, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so there's certainly no costume bitch corner no, on this I, episode. <laughs> So Johnny, Johnny kind of, <laughs> yeah. Johnny was kind of set up for Jackass because he was a really sick child. Uh, at one point, mean? like he got he's sick. sick. He's yeah. sick. Wow. <laughs> we're annoying. Definitely can tell we're halfway uh, through a forty right now. Bringing out a weird part of my personality. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, sick. he was sick. Hey, tell me how sick. Dude, he was sick. Yeah, he's sick. All the time. He was sick all the time. No, for real, he almost died when he was like eight years old. Oh, God. Oh, dude, death is fucking sick. Dude, death is sick. (laughs) That's sick, bro. (laughs) He had the flu, pneumonia, and bronchitis at the same time. And he he was in the hospital for a week and he almost died. He was like eight years old. Oh, that's too much. So he like, he was set up for like, and he had asthma. Like he was set up to be used to being hurt. Yeah, like (laughs) JaVale McGee. Like JaVale. JaVale McGee. Love, love you, McGee. The graphics out there. <laughs> Javel McGee. We're, we're, in over, <laughs> we're, in over, we're in overtime now. We're, we're over the amount of time that I put graphics in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you're still with us, you're you're our real fans. Yeah. Um, so the way the way it all kind of got started you're was only fans. Bam Margera. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! I can't even fucking get a story out. Tell us more. He was sick. Tell us. So so Johnny was Johnny wanted to be an actor since he was 13. He moved to Hollywood right after high school. He was in acting school. He dropped out after six weeks. Damn. Um, he's doing random stunts he's writing at this time for big brother magazine which was a skateboarding magazine and he came up with this idea like why don't we do a segment where like i test out like pepper spray and like random shit like that but i you know i film it and like hurt myself and they're like okay cool let's do it <laughs> what Boom. if i hurt myself on camera <laughs> a star is born right, right. <laughs> at the same time bam margera ryan's on they're doing cky shit yep right and they actually didn't know each other this time they're doing this two separate places oh i didn't know was that spike, was spike jones doing cky at the time spike jones i think joined no, no. when mtv got involved and they made a jackass mm. yeah, spike was- jones joined when they all joined together I was gonna say yeah, because Spike Jones, he was already doing like being John Malkovich in like the late nineties. Yeah, no, he was doing being some big an shit. An artist. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, in the eighties, he was filming skateboarding and BMXing, and then right. he had a film career in the early nineties. Right. Yeah. So, excuse me. Uh, <laughs> oh my God. No one's watching anyway. Right. So, uh, oh. <gasps> <laughs> I want the world to know that is how Nico burps. <laughs> <laughs> when we're hanging out watching sports and shit, he goes, Ugh! and I, I only know because it's been years, <laughs> and I replicate it sometimes for fun. It's a fucking yeah. foghorn. I, I do it by myself. It's so loud. I do it by like a whistle. <laughs> it's so extreme. So it's so extreme. <laughs> it's the only way I burp. Honestly, I don't. I don't burp any other way anymore. I've like I've gotten so used to it that I forgot that it's weird until you just. <laughs> A little glimpse into our friendship. <laughs> I do. I do have a shot bet, though. I actually do have a shot bet. Oh fuck! I do. I have a shot bet. Oh god. Okay. Go. Shit. 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 Shot bet. Oh, uh, Johnny Knoxville got hired onto a TV show. He actually got hired. He got casted onto a TV show. I'm gonna give you three options. Tell me which one it is. Okay. So, before Jackass, right around the time that Jackass was being formed, okay. Johnny Knoxville was hired onto a show. Was it? Are you ready? No. <laughs> <laughs> also, I gotta write with my left hand because yeah. my right hand. Does Brent, re- restart the bit. All right. Yeah. Because yeah. we're just we're. I'm ready. We're <laughs> with my left hand. <laughs> yep, bit. We're 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 we're. So Johnny Knoxville, right before around around the start of Jackass was actually hired onto a television show. Hmm. Uh, he chose Jackass over this television show. Smart move. Or, or was it? Was it? Move? Was the show A, oh. Oh. SNL, oh. Oh. B, Mad TV, oh. or C, In Living Color? Cue the music. Okay. Ladies 
and gentlemen, what did you uh, choose? I chose Mad TV. Mad TV. And you're both taking a shot. God oh, damn it. SNL? What was it? SNL. But, wow. So, he SNL. Turned down he got SNL hired. For he oh, turned yes. down SNL. So, here's here's the story. So, I was thinking it was Mad TV because I was like, oh, SNL is filmed in New York, obviously. I knew both of right. you guys were going to choose Mad TV because it seems like the more obvious answer. Yeah, it really wow. was. SNL hired. It was like right when he was kind of building the name for himself as like a stunt man, crazy yeah. guy, entertaining guy, crazy wanted to be an actor. Uh, they were gonna let him do like basically five minutes every week by himself to do his thing, like to do some crazy stunt, to be entertaining, to you know do his bad grandpa his shit. Clown. Yeah, do what do his Johnny Knoxville thing. Yeah. At the exact same time, he had started to come together with like Bam Margera, Ryan Dunn. They were like That's forming mine. Jackass. And MTV had it was a bidding war between between <laughs> That's SNL, what you sound like. <laughs> SNL, Comedy Central, and Mad TV were all kind of fighting over like signing Jackass. So really? Johnny Knoxville said That's wild. MTV That's offered wild. a shit ton of money, and Johnny Knoxville said that he was choosing him and his friends together versus betting on himself alone. That makes sense. Oh, that's cute. That's Isn't awesome. that fucking cute? And also, I, my little Johnny I have to say that's fucking the right choice because yeah. Jackass had a meteoric rise. It, it did. It really did. Like it went from like little tiny low budget show to right. still around right now, still killing it. Right, 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 right. Yeah, I mean financially, like I'm not sure how much SNL cast members get paid. I'm gonna. I'm but gonna uh, do I don't know either. You think I would know for being a huge SNL stan? Right. Oh my god, here we go. Our fate is being chosen. Soko! Why is that still on the board? Because I still have Soko left. As soon as it's gone, it's not on there. <laughs> Same thing. Same thing. We're, Same. Oh, we're you know, you're both taking we're getting down to oh, the to the god, bits. God, I hate Soko. I mean, it's appropriate for Jackass. You can't have a pleasant shot no, for this the Jackass actually the episode. Per- that was the perfect spin you could have had for this episode. Or the black pepper vodka, because that's kind of like a mm. dare. There's way more of the black pepper vodka than there is Soko, so. <laughs> so Co- gross. All right, shot bet. So. Oh God. No, Brent. How <laughs> many? <laughs> We're right with <laughs> with this one. How many writing credits does Johnny Knoxville have on ID- IMDb? These are big shot glasses, Emily. Are these? It's are these, literally a shot, a shot glass. Are it's these universal? Thick. No, these are just thick. It's definitely not a European shot. I'll tell you that. They're tiny out there. They're a little tiny. It's just an ounce. There. Don't buy a shot in Europe. They're going to give you like a little tiny. My life. It's going to be one ounce exactly. Ah! <laughs> it's fucking gross. Dude, suck gross. it up. Aaron got hit in the balls by a hockey puck. You're fine. <sighs> yeah, this is this is nothing. This is nothing. I still don't like him. <laughs> yeah, yeah Johnny Knoxville has 16 different writing credits on, on Six, IMDb. 16? 16, yeah. So just for writing 60. credits? That's because I'm like slurring. Screenplays or because of... Uh, jackass. Uh, well, Jackass movies. Like Bad he's Grandpa. he's he's talked about yeah, how he acted for a bit, didn't he? His whole his whole goal was to be an actor, not not a stuntman. But at the age of thirteen, he said he wanted to be an actor huh. really young because he felt like it was the most amount of money you could make for the least amount of work. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not he's not wrong. entirely incorrect. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so he he always wanted to be an actor, and then the stunt shit just kind of like happened. How dare you spin, Soko? How dare you? I blame you. I didn't mean to. Resentment is building. (laughs) Leave it in. (laughs) in. That's a throwback to the last trash episode. (laughs) By the way, if you haven't seen our last trash episode, (laughs) if you're watching this for fun facts and to actually learn, that's cool. If you're watching it because you're one of our friends or you've just learned that you actually like us being idiots together. Or you want to be one of our friends. Or you want to be one of our friends. friends. Virtual friends. Anyone who watches the show is our friend. Anyone who watches this and actually thinks that we're funny, God bless you. Uh, There's an episode. You should probably get that checked. (laughs) (laughs) There's an episode that we did on the movie Bad Trip, which is kind of jackassy. I think without Jackass, Bad Trip never gets made. Um, And it's my favorite episode that we will probably ever shoot of this podcast. Yeah. And Eternal I highly Mona, recommend Mona Lisa. going on. <laughs> <laughs> Not like this. Not, Not like, like this. this. Not like this. If you want to watch me Board humiliate law. myself. <laughs> We're not about fart jokes, apparently. I will never let it down. Or actually farting on camera. We're not about any of this shit. It wasn't a fart joke. It was just farting. It was me farting because I had pizza and beer right before the Emily farted on camera. Twice. (laughs) Twice. And Nico and I cry laughed at it. Perfect timing (laughs) on both of them, too. And you know what? 
boardwalk. Plus, you're you are a courageous soul. You Honestly. there's a lot of courage in you that I appreciate and being like yeah whatever just put it on the internet you're so i don't brave. care i'm you're so, so brave, brave. <laughs> I, I am i will say that so completely brave. unsarcastically <laughs> you are so brave so brave i mean that sincerely i appreciate Hold that about camera, you put it up on youtube let's, let's go. go 22 year old m would have been fucking mortified 29 year old m at the time now is like whatever man I don't life f- is fucking short man far on camera and be over it far you know what i mean I can't Fork wait. fucking camera, bro. <laughs> I can't wait to look back when I'm like 60 <laughs> and be like, oh, yeah, that's what I was doing in my late 20s yeah. and 30s. We're going to be in our retirement watching old episodes of CHC. <laughs> yep. Yeah, yeah. You know absolutely. what? At least we're not going to have regrets of talking about CHC this and never actually doing it. This is what I did in 2020. Watch. Watch uh, it. When I was... Thirty-three. I started the podcast. By the way, we're, we're talking to our cats and dogs. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we're not having children. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead already. This yeah, is yeah. you guys talking to your animals. <laughs> Starbuck three. <Yeah. laughs> Are you kidding? It's like Starbuck eight. Yeah. <laughs> you make it all... no, she's going oh, forever. When Wiz dies, you're talking I'm just gonna like have this. him stuffed, and I'll be talking to that. <laughs> okay, <I'll laughs> if you're same. talking like this, it's probably Starbuck seven or eight by that point. <laughs> gonna make her into a little hat. <laughs> Wear around. <laughs> <laughs> a little sombrero hurt. She's, yeah. Yeah, that'd be good. Oh. Hurry, 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 hurry. Are we done talking about Jack? Gotta finish this. Uh, gotta finish. Uh, hurry up, you bitches. Gotta drink my drink. Gotta drink my drink. <laughs> drink, uh. drink my drink. Um. A little ASMR of us. <laughs> ASMR? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Oh my god. Brent, you got any if more anyone fun facts? is if anyone's staying to watch <laughs> so it's Hi so Brandon. St- oh my god. <laughs> Hi Christina. This for real. Th- this is like this episode's d- like devolving real well, real quick. Th- it reminds me of that part in Jackass to oh. thread it back through. Thank you. Where uh <laughs> Rachel's like, Oh, you're you're never gonna be president. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're never gonna oh, run for president. You're definitely never gonna be president. <laughs> It's like mm. it's Chris is it, it was Chris right squishing his penis between right. like two pieces of plexiglass. Also, can we talk about that? How did he get his dick? It, it was wasn't like that. that. It wasn't that. It was more like that. Was it? No. Yeah, no. It, it was thinner than that, Emily. It was thinner, than that. It was thinner than, that. than that. And by, by the way, dicks are very like squishy, and malleable. Are you they? have a fucking penis. Are they? Yeah. Are when they? they're when they're flaccid, yeah. Flaccid, are they? flaccid dick. I don't really play with it. Where do you a shower? Dude, you just are next, yeah. like next that. Time, yeah. Next, I'm next not, time, I'm a grower, not a shower. That's the opposite of what I was saying. Yeah, no, it's 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 kind of embarrassing. I shrink time. when I get hard. So <laughs> <laughs> I get I'm hard shrinker, inside right? my body. <laughs> it's actually doctors call it some crazy shit that I can't think of because I'm drunk. <laughs> I'm just hard all the time, and then when I get turned on, I go soft. The- <laughs> that made me laugh really hard because of how hard you laughed at it. It came out and you immediately started laughing so hard that it got me. <laughs> I'm imagining my parents listening. Like, hey. I know this is so bad. <laughs> I can't so believe bad. we're putting this on the internet. This is so dumb. I'm cutting that out. Don't cut that out. That was uh, hilarious. Yeah, I'm cutting my it mom out. recently was like, "Oh, I'm such a bad mom. I'm not caught up on your podcast." I'm like, "Oh, that's fine. Like a lot of the movies, you're not like gonna want to watch." Mm-hmm. This one, mom, no, no. I'll I be like, think "Mother, mom. no, huh?" <laughs> <laughs> oh no! I mentioned at the beginning the when I was talking about the pig scene when I told mom that she should turn it off and go watch something else. My mom is extremely supportive. I don't think she watches this podcast very. Much. <laughs> <laughs> What's important is that she puts it on and just like leaves the room. That way we get the views. Oh, that, that was a supportive be, parent. That would be supportive. My hands that getting sweaty. Nice. I'm gonna finish this right now. Uh, finish it so you can take it off. Like that's the reward. Here we go. Oh God. I can't chug. I'm not a chugger. Done. Come on, Em. Get it together. Freedom. 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 I can't Freedom. chug. Freedom. Oh Ow. All right. Ugh. That's quite enough. I know. I'm so <laughs> irritated at this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Release the finger. <laughs> Oh, oh my god. god, that feels great. God, my pinky finger was. It's like we just had handcuffs on, uh, and we're like, oh, wrist. I had like claustrophobia from the finger. <laughs> like it was just so <laughs> squeezed in and cold. Oh, thank uh, god. This is my life now. 
All right, How many well, watermelon boats do you guys give this movie? Oh yeah, you took. I was be like, we forgot fucking <laughs> watermelon boats. Watermelon boats yet. Okay, yeah. I pulled a lot of uh, arm hair off. Ow. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm gonna well, compare we this to like of... to jackass movies. We didn't do a, we didn't have our watermelon boat rating when we did Bad Trip, but I would like compare oh, it kind of within that realm. <sighs> yeah, no, we're not comparing <laughs> we're Jackass not comp- Forever to House <laughs> of Gucci. No, I'll do entertainment value. Is, is how I'm judging this. Sure, absolutely. It's not winning any fucking Oscars. Some fucking plot. Plot. <laughs> I was entertained the whole time. Like, of course. Watch I was it. smiling the whole. You know, like I said once before. I <laughs> <laughs> trash episode is in full effect right when now. When I know I like a movie, is when I notice myself smiling. Just. You know, it's such I was, a, I a serial shitty... killer thing to say. Right. I just... If I notice that I'm smiling, I realize that I like it. Like, oh, what a weird thing to say. <laughs> well, so, you know, when you're just watching a film, you know notice... oh, I must be enjoying this. My mouth has turned upwards. <laughs> My mouth has turned upwards. <laughs> I really know I like a movie when I'm smiling while watching the movie. <laughs> and that's how I know I like it. If I'm not smiling, I think that I probably don't like it very much. I, it's true. <laughs> <laughs> this sounds, sounds stupid, stupid, but like, like uh huh, uh huh. I don't know. Like, keep going. Anyway, I was smiling the whole time, so eight. <laughs> so eight. Um. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna meet you at eight. Yeah, because I think Ooh. meet me there. I think I liked I Jackass three more than this one a little bit just like jackass 3 sticks in my mind so much also because it was 3d and it was the best use of right. 3d oh, i don't think i ever. saw jackass 3 oh dude, oh, dude. you had to have seen it in the theaters because it, like, it, yeah. theaters it was right around the time when like every movie is in 3d and it was like <laughs> right yeah it was, it, was, it was a hit or miss the, hella played the, up the, on the that. post oh, avatar era dude, where everything was in fucking 3d that and the harold and kumar sequel i was like these are the best uses of 3d and nothing right, will ever right. beat this also, also, lucky for them, it was their third movie. Exactly. So the 3D like, exactly. works. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. It like good for them. Genius. Good, good for them. them. <laughs> that yeah, I think that one might still be my favorite. But yeah, I will go an eight because okay. like fuck, I enjoyed the hell out of it. Was 3D, go... was 3D a nine for you? Yeah. You say? Nine. Okay. Yeah. I don't I'm know what gonna... would be a ten, but so again, hey, Larissa's calling you. Oh, <laughs> oh. Hey, babe. Uh, hey, babe. Hi, hey, babe. Larissa. <laughs> Hi, babe. Uh. I judge on the type of movie. So for this type of movie, this is a fucking nine for me. Nice. Fun type. This is a nine. Okay. If I'm going there <laughs> to like bullshit and laugh with my friends at some stupid shit on a screen, aka Which is Jackass what you did. or Bad Trip. Just yeah. basically well, I mean, those are the only movies that, yeah. that I criteria. think it might also be rated higher if our theater had been more full. That's what I mean. Like Yeah. It was it was kind of well, fun yeah, the fact that we Saturday felt like we had our own. Why wasn't it fuller? Yeah, dude, COVID times. COVID. So there's no one. COVID. It's, oh, hold on. No, I know. Omarion. No. Omarion is all is all up in this. Spider Man. It's like the fourth highest right. grossing movie of all time. But also, COVID times. imagine that happening not in COVID times. It would probably be the number one grossing movie of all time. Maybe. I mean, it's it's hard to to judge. However, I am surprised at how empty the theater was. That was yeah, that, that was way emptier so than weird. I thought it would be on a weekend. Yeah. And it just six, came out. 6.30 p.m. And it was a showing. 90% on Rotten Tomatoes. And it that just was, came out. That was so strange. Yeah. I, I honestly expected to walk into a full theater and there was like nine other people. Full-ish. In there. But at least it at was least it being there busy. There were like over 20 people in the theater, I would say. You think? Yeah. That's not a lot. Ow, ow. No, it's not a lot, but it's ow, more than. Ow. Don't you take that off yet? Do, don't you take that? Don't off take yet. that. You have to finish your drink before you take it off. We That's can't even pro- finish the episode. The in price time. of freedom. <laughs> <laughs> is Careful! Very... I'm gonna spit Mickey's at you. <laughs> <laughs> Bukaki Mickey's Daddy's at getting you. Sober, yeah. <laughs> Daddy's getting sober. <laughs> He's not. <laughs> we know. <laughs> He's not sober. We know. I'm, I'm spending the night here tonight. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, oh, that's news to me. 
<laughs> you get the bean bag. <laughs> you get the bean bag? Yeah, I'll take the couch. <laughs> <laughs> you live down the street, basically. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna drive. You're gonna 80, ha- I'm no. gonna drive 85 all the way home. You're gonna hang <laughs> here for a while. Everyone's gonna hang out here and starting now. Go, 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 go. go you really go. can't chug. Oh, I can't. I you can't. really can't chug. What? You and Larissa both can't chug. I can't do it. Give her a straw. She'll finish. I can it do probably. many things. I thought, I, you were, I, thought, I thought you were. We're waiting for her to finish her drink. I've got a little sip. Hold on. I've got a burp building right, let's, up. Let's I can't clap sip her. on Ready? top of this. Can you burp? We're gonna we're gonna slow clap for Emily. My body takes a screenshot of it. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> she said her body takes a screenshot if she burps and farts at the same time. <laughs> that actually is. That actually, that actually is really funny. That's literally the funniest thing I've ever heard me say. My body oh, takes a shit. screenshot. Oh, shit. Oh, that was off the cuff, too. That was so quick. My body Ooh. takes a screenshot. <laughs> That is really funny. God, that is really funny. funny. <laughs> oh, uh, man, what a great way to end this episode. <laughs> no, I'm cutting all that out. No, there's no <laughs> fucking way you're cutting that. That's the header. That's the header at the beginning of the episode. Yeah, you're right. I did it. Yeah. <laughs> we get to end the episode. <laughs> I'm so glad we got that in before. <laughs> it's not a trash episode if you don't cry laugh. Yeah. That's true. And the episode completely just... And also, that was Emily. Emily both times has caused no. me to cry laugh for <laughs> trash <laughs> <episode>. <laughs> You gotta find the start of the tape, girl. Oh my god! <laughs> you did it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Just your hand. Nothing's wrong with it. You, you guys are never gonna run for president. That's for sure. All right. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. Cheers, everyone. For Cheers. the seven of you that made it to here, we appreciate you. <laughs> Tell a friend about this show. See you right. next time. <laughs>